Hello everyone, today I'm in the forest and as you can see, I'm not alone. I'm with Maria, my daughter. Spune bună, Maria. Bună! And because it's a warm autumn day, probably it's going to be the last autumn days that are this, this warm. Um, we decided to bring Maria out in the forest and to take some photos of her. So The gear that I'm going to use is going to be a Canon 6D with the 85mm 1.8 and also the 70 to 200mm uh, <laughs> As you can see, Maria is very excited for this photo shoot. Uh, the only difference is that uh, the telephoto, this telephoto has a polarizer filter on. I don't know if it's needed, but we'll have to see. So we're going to start photographing with the 85mm lens. As you can see, the place is not that special. It's not something that's different or a spectacular place. It's a normal forest and that is the idea to, to go in a normal place and to get some interesting shots. I can see birds flying I see children smiling It's pretty difficult to interact with children that are so little. Maria is almost three but you need to have a lot of patience and for the moment I'm trying to convince her to stay in this spot to help me with this thing that I'm doing and the only thing that she needs to do is to play, is to be herself and at this age children I don't think they can act or they can do something that you tell them to do so if Maria would let me today I'm gonna take some good photos stay at an aperture of 2.2 or 2.8 maximum, but I, I think I will start with 2.2. I saw 320 and exposure time. I just have to do some test shots and see and see exactly what I need. I want to be with you both days. This is the moment when you can place a subject right in the middle. And another thing, you can. And another thing, yeah, as you can see, Maria has some white clothes on them, on her, and uh, also uh, a hat that it's bright. And this will help me with creating a, a good separation. Mm -hmm. The dress, mm -hmm. she she wanted this, this dress. <laughs> she wanted this dress. Uh, I had no other option, but this white coat will help me separate her better from uh, from the rest of the landscape. <laughs> so, she knows... She said, she said, look daddy, I took a photo of the leaves. So she already knows how to handle the camera now. Uh, this is another thing, you need to be patient enough and to let the child play, even with your own camera. Mom, yeah. <laughs> if you want to get some interesting <laughs> photos after that because a happy child means good photos you don't want a crying child at your photo shoot I can see birds flying I see children smiling When I think about All of the things that you and me could be I want to be with you both day and night To sit on the grass beneath the moonlight I know that life won't last forever But at least we can grow old To 
together I can see this Another thing that I did was to place my camera on continuous shooting because you don't want to miss a moment or a phase that the child is making it's absolutely 100% sure that you will not be able to repeat that and that is why I need to capture it she doesn't want to do photos anymore so this will be for today and I hope you like it I hope you found it interesting if you have questions just use the comment section below subscribe to this YouTube channel and until next time keep on photographing because it's the only way that you can get better